In this video, I would take, like to take a look at a couple of updates to the Strip Foundation drawn. And for this, I'm going to use an example of a student's drawing that's done here. The 50mm edge insulation shown up here will be changed to 80mm. Uh, the cross hatch that you see here, shown saving you having to draw in a whole load of blocks, should include cavity ties. The first tie would be at the very bottom. I'm not drawing it in heavy and purpose because I don't want it to take away from the DPC, which is coloured in blue, and the DPM red. And instead, I'm drawing the first cavity up there at a cavity tie at 450 millimeters. So quite easy to uh, include in there. Then this area in here where you see that there would be the gap of the insulation because that obviously that's where the insulation would start. Uh, I'm going to shade in a block area here, which could be an aerated block, which would increase the thermal value or thermal properties at this point, reducing the possibility of a thermal bridge. And even better in that again will be if the aerated block was actually the height of the floor above that. So it could be shaded above that as well too. So uh, other things then, maybe the cavity, it's 350mm cavity here. That could be increased up to a 200mm cavity. And just all the other details. Other, other than that there, the rest of the drawing is pretty much perfect. It's got all the details in here. And uh, the, of course the 80mm edge insulation as well.